Who are you? How did you find this place? Refugee camp? Is that what they're calling it? Good old NCR. They can whitewash anything. Let me tell you something. That refugee camp, it's built on the blood and tears of my people. Nobody likes to talk about it, but I remember. I know that, but what else can I do? Maybe. Maybe you're right. Maybe three years is vengeance enough. Thank you for helping me see that. Here, this will unlock the supply caches we left in caves around these mountains. You might get some use out of them. Smart move for the kings to back down. Anything else I can do for you? You did? Who was it? Any information you could give me would be a big help for my reports. Really? Well, this canyon used to be a great Khan stronghold. I suppose that explains why he was able to evade us so easily. About three years ago, NCR's first recon launched an attack on the Khan encampment here. There was a communication mix-up that resulted in some non-combatants being killed. I guess he was still bitter about it. It was a tragic mistake, but we've done all we can to make amends. We provided medical aid to the wounded, all the wounded, and permitted the cons to resettle at Red Rock Canyon. I don't know how you did it, but thank you. Again, thank you. This is a huge help. Good luck. They didn't know who they were messing with. Smart move for the kings to back down. They didn't know who they were messing with.
range of the Oh, yeah.
Oh, thank God. I didn't think I'd ever see another human face down here. You must be the backup I've been calling for. Where are the rest of your men? 
shit. Do you have any damn idea what lives in these caves? We need to get out of... We need to go now! I don't know, some kind of man-fish freak like the one I killed over there. I heard fishermen spin old tales of lake lurks swimming in the water. I always thought they were just bullshit mermaid stories. Thanks a lot, Doc. I think I should be able to walk out of here now. I don't want to risk running into a pack of those freaks alone, though. Could you escort me out of here? Are you crazy? No way in hell am I going deeper into those caves. You haven't seen what they did to the other troopers, and I'd rather not find out why they took all of the bodies. All right, you have a point. They were good men and deserved better. Can't guarantee I'll be much help against their numbers, but I'll do what I can. Chances are we won't get out of here alive anyway. Lead on. Thanks for getting me out of there. I better get started back to California. I know, but now that I can see the way out, I'm not so sure. I'd rather not join my dead buddies anytime soon. I'm gonna start heading back to California now. I'm not about to let myself get killed by future NCR incompetence. If you find my friends, please return their dog tags to the NCR. People need to know what happened here. If they won't listen, do what you can to make them listen. The dead need to be avenged. What's up? This is the f south of here is Camp Guardian, but they've been having raid. Gareth. Hey.
Don't need this right now.
I ought to bleed you. So the NCR makes peace with the kings now? Where was that mercy at Bitter Springs? Nice robot. Fuck off and die. The runners are saying that the NCR is sending in their elite shock troops Not to now, try and push back the Legion. Seems like everybody with a stake in the Mojave is gearing up for something big. Seems like everybody with a stake in the Mojave is gearing up for something big. tell you they're a bunch of big dumb jerks with no appreciation for art. I mean, can you believe their initiation? Everybody has to do it. Well, everybody who wants to be a con anyways. They toss you into the ring there and beat on you for a solid minute. If you survive, you're in. Sure, maybe not if you're some hulking reprobate like Regis or big to the gills like Jack. I've tried five times and still haven't made it. Yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe I can find my true calling, someplace they'll appreciate my poetry. Someplace like the old Mormon fort, maybe. Do you think the followers of the Apocalypse would take me? I remember all those books they brought us when they visited our tribe. You'd do that? Thanks! I mean, I'd go myself, but what if they said no? The cons wouldn't take me back, and then I'd have nobody. Ah, uh, nothing really. Just trying to psych myself up to try my initiation. Again. Oh, you heard that, huh? Okay, so, yeah, I was writing poetry. I know, I know, it's not a very great con-like thing to do. The followers of the Apocalypse came to our camp when I was a kid, and they brought a bunch of old books. I used to read pre-war poetry for hours. Have you seen this tribe? If it's not an epic drunken ballad of cracking skulls and hearing lamentations, they think it's a waste of time. Yeah, well, I guess maybe I'm not. But what else can I do? Sure, okay. You would? Really? Okay, well then, here goes. <clears throat> I wrote this limerick the last time I went to Freeside. There once was a fellow called Garrett, whose sister she did love to bear it. She flashed it around all over town, so if you would screw her, beware it. I, uh, 
Got kicked out of the Atomic Wrangler for that one. <laughs> That's it. What do you think? You liked it? Wow, you're the first one who ever did. Mr. House isn't a man to be trusted. Watch yourself. to bleed you. I heard from one of Melissa's runners that that check-coated bastard got thrown out on his ass. I heard from one of Melissa's runners that that check-coated bastard got thrown out on his ass. The runners are saying that the NCR is sending in their elite shock troops to try and push back the Legion.
So the NCR makes peace with the kings now? Where was that mercy? We're not moving as many chems now that the fiends have been taken out. You're not one of my regulars. What do you want? We keep the great cons from falling apart, essentially. Jack manufactures the chems. I organize the runners and the shipments. We're supplying things people want in exchange for things our tribe needs. Don't judge us. We make regular shipments to a lot of settlements around the Mojave. A lot of our business comes from the fiends lately. Personally, I think they're kind of creepy, but Papa likes the fact they get all hopped up on Psycho and harass the NCR patrols. Like what? I'll spare you the history lesson. Talk to Papa Khan if you want to hear that story. Things have been rough for a while now. Even with Jack working all the time and my runners making deliveries daily, we're barely getting by. Maybe this alliance with Caesar will help, but I don't know. Red Rock Canyon isn't exactly the most hospitable place. There's no food, barely any water, and nothing anybody wants. We used to send patrols out to acquire supplies, but ever since Bitter Springs, there just aren't enough of us left. Sure. Helpful? What, like bathtub stim packs? What's the point of that? That's touching. Make it quick. I don't want to be seen. Helpful? You've got a point. Selling meds to the locals could be a pretty nice side gig. All right, I'll tell Jack to give it a try. Yeah, you made a pretty good argument. We'll keep it small for now, but if it turns a profit, we might expand. Jack handle. Anything else? Whoa, new guy. Do. We don't like do anything. We make the magic happen. We make the happy stuff. What do you need? Jet? Psycho? A little Med-X to ease the pain? Guess I just had a natural talent for it. When I was a kid, these cats called the followers of the apocalypse came to our camp. They knew all kinds of kooky, scientastical stuff, so... I ate up all the chemistry they could teach. Diane had the head for business, so we teamed up. Diane's my girl, man. We've been taking care of each other our whole lives, ever since our folks died. Now we keep the cons and caps together. They're family, you dig? They've always looked out for us, made sure we had something to eat and a place to crash. Papa may look like a big angry bear, but he's a softy at heart. Regis is cool, scary, but cool. The rest are all pretty groovy, even little Jerry. Uh, the other dudes call him Jerry the Punk. That's kind of harsh, though. I think he's just a sensitive soul that needs some love. He's usually down around the proving ground if you want to say yo. Huh? Look, man, me and Diane, we don't dig on that politics stuff, savvy? We just make the product and make it get to a good home. Sure, Caesar's a drag, but as long as we've got each other, we don't care who the top dogs roll with. Already on it. I whipped up a few stim packs already. But if you've got any more recipes, I'll take them. Oh, you're buying. Cool. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Take it easy. Diane's going nuts trying to find a new contact in the fiends now that motor
Silver. Silver what? Silver eyes? No, eyes doesn't work. Huh? Hmm. I really don't want to deal with. Huh? Wait, what are you talking about? We're allied with Caesar now? <sighs> Typical. Nobody tells me anything. But hmm. indulgent. What rhymes with indulgent? Nice robot. I ought to bleed you. We're not moving as many chems now that the fiends have been taken out. Caesar's veterans will arrive from Arizona soon, and there will be no stopping our victory. My name is Carl. Glorious Caesar has sent me as an emissary to the Great Khans as a token of our alliance. In exchange for Great Caesar's promise of all the lands west of New Vegas, the Khans have agreed to fight alongside the Legion when the time comes. Though they have been cruelly oppressed by the NCR, the Khans remain great warriors. The Legion is honored to have such allies in battle. I am one of the Frumentari. It is my duty to scout the waste in Caesar's name and make contact with any tribes that might serve a useful purpose. You might say I'm somewhere between a scout and an ambassador. I'm assigned here as part of the alliance between the Legion and the Great Khans. Speak then. I haven't seen you before. What brings you to the Great Khan? Name's Regis. I'm Papa Khan's advisor and right-hand man. I'm also the chief enforcer of the tribe's laws, so watch your behavior. Papa is one of the best leaders the Khans have ever had. He's kept us together through all of our hardships, ever since we left California. Bitter Springs changed him, though. He started to really hate the NCR after the massacre. And sometimes, I worry that's poisoned his mind. Nothing. Forget about it. I shouldn't be talking about this with an outsider. 
That's a complicated question. They've done horrible things to our people, to be sure, and I've gladly killed many of their soldiers in battle. But I can't bring myself to hate them the way Papa does. Things would damn sure be better for us if they were in charge than Caesar. I suppose if asked, I would. But that's a moot point, because Papa's in charge now, and he's not going anywhere. And I ought to bleed you. So the cub enters the wolf's den. What do you want, cub? You march all the way out to Red Rock Canyon, enter my home as bold as you please, and you have no idea who I am? You've got guts, I'll give you that. Well then, let me educate you. I am the chief of the great Khans, the Khan of Khans, if you like. This is my tribe, and these are my people. You want to hear the story of the great Khans? It's a long one, full of honor, glory, and betrayal. We have suffered, but we will regain our glory. In a hurry, are you? Very well, then. The great Khans came east, out of the NCR 14 years ago. We ruled the wastes then, and called no man master. But we underestimated the families of the Strip, and they drove us back to Bitter Springs, where we remained until the NCR arrived and drove us here. They allied with Mr. House, the self-proclaimed master of New Vegas. He supported them with the resources of New Vegas. Weapons, technology, caps. They were better equipped, and we could not stand against them. When the NCR came to the Mojave, we thought they would be easy pickings. We raided their caravans, their towns, their camps. They couldn't stop us. At least that's what we thought. They tracked us to Bitter Springs and surrounded us. When our children, our sick and old, fled through a nearby pass, the NCR gunned them down. Oh, they claimed it was a miscommunication, but tell that to those who saw our families butchered. Tell it to the survivors who were banished here. Typical. No reference for history in the younger generations. Have you now? Hmm. Well, you're a bold one, I'll give you that. But why should I do this for you? Ha! The great Khans will not be slaves. Caesar himself has promised us the land from here to the Colorado and the freedom to raid as we see fit. I won't hear any more talk against Caesar or his alliance. The great Khans will answer Caesar's call to war, and the NCR will pay for their crimes. If you're smart, you'll f bitter sp I really don't like to talk about it. Let's just say it was a tragedy, and the NCR is to blame, and we'll leave it at that. Fuck off and Not now, die. I'm busy. I heard you try to convince Papa Khan not to join with Caesar's Legion. I'd like to talk to you about that for a moment. You want to convince Papa not to ally with Caesar, right? Trust me, you'll get nowhere just talking to him about it. He's fixated on restoring the glory of the great Khans, and he sees Caesar as the path to that restoration. Papa can be a stubborn man, but he's not a tyrant. He listens to his tribe, and to four voices in particular. Me, Jack, Diane, and Melissa. If you can convince all of us that allying with Caesar is a bad idea, you might be able to sway him. You'd have to talk to them, but those two have been thick as thieves since they were kids. Convince one, and the other will come around. Ah, Melissa. She's a bit of a dreamer. Last time she was in camp, Carl filled her head with stories of serving the Legion as a speculatore. Personally, I've never seen a woman in Legionnaire's armor, so I have my doubts. I have my doubts about Caesar, yes, but I won't publicly go against Papa Khan based on nothing more than doubts. I've heard rumors that tribes who aligned with Caesar in the past were torn apart and reduced to slaves. Prove it, and I'll back you.
Good. Oh, one more thing. Caesar's representative, Carl, has become fast friends with Pava. Carl's the one who has him so fixated on this alliance. You'll probably have an easier time of things if you can find a way to get him out of the picture. Carl talks prettily about the honor and nobility of the great cons, but I suspect his actual opinion is less flattering. Maybe you could find something he wrote that expresses that opinion, or trick him into losing his cool in the longhouse right in front of Papa. I would too, if I were you. You're the one who's been going around help. Like the Legion might be preparing for another run at the dam. This can't be good. One of my aides said you got into the Lucky 38. If you see someone by the name of Emily near there, we would like you to work for us. We're always looking for new members. Does he have any particular talent? Excellent. Ezekiel's been after me to find him a new assistant for ages. Tell the boy we'll take him. I'm honestly pleasantly surprised they would help us out. But I can see the Garretts aren't doing this out of the goodness of their hearts. Well, it looks like you've earned yourself a discount on supplies now that we'll be fully covered. This supply deal will aid our work immensely. Yeah? Damn it, someone off Motor Runner. That guy was one of our biggest clients. Hey, it's not like I'm super attached to working with Caesar or anything. But if he'll stop his patrols from harassing my runners, I'm all for it. I haven't heard anything like that. Do you have any proof? Okay. Come on back when you do. Well, it's not like I'm super attached to working with Caesar or anything. But if he'll stop his patrols from harassing my runners, I'm all for it. Papa hasn't stared us wrong yet. Catch you later. Seems like everybody with a stake of the Mojave is gearing up for something big. Everybody 
Diane's going nuts trying to find a new contact in the Maybe theme. I should now write something Mulder about how much dead. the great cons suck. Silver. What? They did? Oh, that's great. Thank you. I'm out of this crummy camp. Soon, Caesar will send in his best I'm so much happier now. Camp. Thank you again. Caravan of two now. Halt! What business have you in Cottonwood Cove, outsider? Very well, you may proceed. However, be warned. Aggressive acts against us will earn you a place on a cross. I keep an eye out for rangers in black armor. I haven't killed one yet. You're the one Lucullus said would come. You'll find him waiting for you down at the docks. Very well. As much as their cowardice will allow, the profligates avoid open battle. But on good days, we find one of their patrols. Their landmines have caused us more trouble than their marksmanship, which is lacking. A legion outpost, what's it look like? Uh, we crossed the river when the profligates fled from Searchlight. From here, we stage raiding parties and process captures. I am an officer of the Legion of the Rank de Conus. When we encamped, I commanded a contabernium of eight legionaries. So I command what's left, under the wise leadership of Centurion Aurelius, of course. Are we done? Awful here. Can't you help us? Hurry up. The guards keep eyeing me like I'm a piece of meat. We're being held here against our will. I beg you, help us. Sorry, I'm just glad someone is doing something. The last thing I need is to be made some legionary's bitch and sent off to God knows where. Awe, true to Kaisar. Please, sir. Take pity on us. Free us, please. My family was ambushed by a pack of Legion raiders near Searchlight, and Frank ran off, the gutless coward. I have no idea where he is, but at least we're free from his abuse. Ever since he lost his job a few years back, he hasn't been the same. He took a switch to us for the tiniest things. We were trying to get away when the Legion showed up. I'm glad he ran off like a coward. 
But slavery wasn't the kind of escape I was looking for. Thank you. Thank you so much. Our way, true to Kaisar. I see you bear the mark of Caesar. Cursor Lucullus awaits you at the dock. When will we be free? No way. If the guard catches you, we'll be beaten. If you want to help, get that gate unlocked, or see if you can get the one they call Canyon Runner to let us go. Ox. Kaisar does not like to be kept waiting. I would find Cursor Lucullus quickly and travel to the fort if I were you. He should still be waiting at the docks. Awe, true to Kaisar. True to Kaisar. Profligate bearing the mark of Kaisar. What is the world coming to? Cursor Lucullus is waiting for you with the barge at the docks. He will take you to the fort to speak with Kaisar. Cursor Lucullus is waiting for you at the docks. He'll take you to Kaisar. As much as the profligate's cowardice will allow, they haven't found the balls to attack us here, but we catch them out on patrols. With two Contubernia at my command, I've killed and captured four times my numbers. Wale. Keeping quiet. Away. True to Kaisar. Hello. Please, help me. Thank God. Let me down, please. Thanks for getting me down from that cross. I owe you one. A Legion patrol caught me trying to cross the river. When they found the, um, package I was carrying, they strung me up there. Well, not exactly. More like trying to expand our markets. I heard there was a lot of untapped territory down south, but the Legion caught me. 
They did? <laughs> Probably mostly Jack's idea. He always was the soft touch. Thanks. You've saved my life and done the Great Khans a huge favor. I'll be heading back to Red Rock Canyon now. Maybe we'll see each other there. Okay, but keep it quick. I'd like to get out of here before the Legionnaires come to check. So long. Like, we don't have enough problems. Anders told me what happened. We owe you one for rescuing him. Tell you what. I can give you caps as a thank you or a special recipe Jack cooked up. Here you go. Enjoy it. With Anders out of commission for so long, we're short-handed on runners, and some backlogs have piled up. We've got an associate in the Crimson Caravan Trading Company, who distributes for us and out of Vegas. He's been after us for a new shipment. Great. Here's the package. Your contact is Don Hostetler at the Crimson Caravan. Come back and see me when you're done. Why do you have to harsh my mellow? Just be cool, you did. Huh? Look, man, me and Diane, we don't dig on that politics stuff, savvy? We just make the product and make it get to a good home. Sure, Caesar's a drag, but as long as we've got each other, we don't care who the top dogs roll with. Dude, what a total haul. No way that's Copa Shishi. Yeah, okay, me and Diane got your back. No sweat. Oh, it's cool, man. I got your back. Someone's been picking off the leaders of the fiends down in New Vegas. Don't worry, Jack and I have talked it over. We'll talk up the idea of breaking the Alliance. Something with more.
That's close enough. What do you want with the Great Khans? Awaiting a delivery, but it's a no-show. I'm guessing that the Death Claws in the quarry have something to do with that. Supplies to make chems. The NCR is the best source since they're hard to come by anywhere else. We don't really use the chems ourselves, just sell them to anybody with the caps. If it ends up hurting the NCR in the process, that's a bonus. I know something of your reputation with my gang, and I can't be seen working with you. Sorry, but I'll handle this. Like, we're an independent. Bitter springs happened. Women and children died when the NCR attacked the Great Khans there. And the NCR just pretends it never happened. Our main camp is up in Red Rock Canyon, but we don't allow just anyone to come in. The NCR can't touch us there. Too many places for us to ambush them. We see their scouts poking around once in a while, but they keep their distance. It wasn't easy. There's a lot of initiation rituals to go through, and I've got the scars to prove it. But in the end, I was tough enough to be made a member. Proudest day of my life. What do you want now? You can ask, but why would I do that? Carl told me all about the life in the Legion. He says I've got all the makings of a speculatory. What? No, he... What do you mean, aren't allowed to serve? Why would he lie about that? That lying little weasel. I almost fell for it, too. All right, you've got a deal. You can tell Papa I won't support an alliance. Bye. We're not moving as many cams now that the fiends have been taken out. Hello. More of my advisors are starting to talk openly of breaking our alliance. I wonder where that idea is coming from. Let me see that. Filthy savages. Probably have to decimate the lot of them. Are these the words of our friend, Caesar? Great cons. Drive Caesar's dog out of our camp. If he's too slow to flee, Kill him! Hey! Mr. You're becoming quite the political act. What do you want? Papa can be... That's a compliment, but I, I... Your house isn't a man to be trusted. Watch yourself. All four of my most trusted advisors have told me we should break our alliance. Maybe I should hear you out after all. Hmm. I've heard some things from my most trusted cons. It makes me wonder whether this alliance is a good idea after all. But I want to leave a legacy of greatness when I die. My tribe deserves better than this, cowering in a canyon and living on scraps. Tell me then, if I don't join with Caesar's Legion, where will I find my tribe's lost glory? The followers of the Apocalypse keep many records of the past. It's been a long time since we associated with them, but they might have something. Until you do find me something, though, know that I still plan to lead the Great Khans to fight for Caesar.
Well spoken, traveler. Well spoken indeed. Perhaps it's time to find our own destiny, unburdened by the past. We'll begin readying the camp to move. As soon as Caesar makes his move, we'll depart. We will make ourselves strong again, and we shall conquer. If you should ever tire of wandering alone, seek us out. You might just have the makings of a great con yourself. Self. Something else you wanted? Pop Bitter Springs changed. I would have thought the monorail bombing would slow the NCR down more. The mark of Kaisar protects you. That machine looks like a floating eye. I don't like it. Awe, true to Kaisar. Away. True to Kaiser. Move along. 